Okay, feel free to regain stamina at your leisure. No! No, we died! Oh my god, that was so much harder than I thought, and I thought we did it! What is up the world? That is your friendly neighborhood shipwreck Van Dam here, hanging out today, doing stuff with things, playing some more hot Atlas action. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for coming to hang out with me today. Oh my God, guys, do I got some stuff and things to show you. Make sure if you like the video that you see, please don't forget, show your support and smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new and you haven't already and you like what you see, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Uh, this is on fire. We're on fire over here. Why is this on fire? Who's doing this? So you guys, yesterday, in, in yesterday's video of Salvation, we made the Sloop, our very first deal. Now, uh, because we are playing on the Community Salvation server, a lot has happened. Yesterday was the first day that Salvation opened, and boy, oh boy, was it something to see. Um, a very successful launch. Let's go ahead and... Can we knock on wood? Hold on. Let me go over here. Knock on wood. Wait. Knock on wood? Can we knock on this wood? Okay. We knocked on wood. Uh, very successful launch. Unbelievable and amazing. And a huge shout out to LogicServers.com who does our server hosting for setting up the server stuff and things. Look what I found. A plank. A massive shout out to everybody that helped to make Salvation happen. Uh, Zuljan, Drax, Zapdos, Mousy, and tons of other people were working on this. Um, and it really made an unbelievable and amazing day for us. Very, very successful. And in one day, you guys are going to be blown away by what's happened, man. An unbelievable amount of stuff has gone on. Uh, and this server is going to be a little bit different, man. You know, uh, previously in all the videos that we've done on the YouTubes, we haven't done a lot of fan server stuff and things. And so, you know, you guys are used to this progression where I'm like, hey, everybody, today we're going to make a sloop. And then at the end, I'm like, yay, we did it. We accomplished our goal. Um, these videos are going to be a little bit different because we're accomplishing goals and doing stuff as a community now. And there's a huge amount of people on our community. We have 124 people currently in our, uh, what do they call it in this company? Currently in our company, the booty barnacles, 124 sexually attractive, unbelievable and amazing people. Ah, almost fell off. And it's been kind of crazy. It's been kind of crazy. So now we have some better weapons. We got our guns out now. We've got this guy right here. Check it out, man. Hot rifle action. This thing works great, too. No scope required. Um, and yeah, we've just been having an amazing time. Now, let me show you where we are. The booty barnacles have set up over here. Look at the booty. Look, these are all the people in our... These are all the... Wait, are these all the people in our company? I mean, I can't even believe that's true. They've set up on different islands, it looks like. I didn't realize that that was a thing. So between yesterday and today, lots of things have happened, and we're learning a lot. Look at our company over here. This is where we're set up here. Um, on Scattered Isles over in the southeast section of C2. Um, and so we've got a lot of stuff and things going on. And it's been, like I said, pretty good. It looks a little confusing on there. We're trying our best to make sure we're regulating the community and following the rules, um, of which there are a few. Uh, but so far, it's been pretty good. But um, all right. So let me guys show you something else that's been going on. Let me go ahead and show you this guy right here. I'm going to go ahead and put that like that. We're going to go ahead and go this like so. And then we check this out. You ready? Bam! Wingsuit, baby! That's what I'm talking about! Oh, yeah! I believe I can fry! Whoa! I believe I can fry on my island! Oh, yeah! Oh, whoa! Dude, look how amazing this wingsuit is, dude! It's so freaking crazy and cool! And then you want to see some of this action? Oh, yeah! Straight down, baby! Look at these builds! Look at our community! Our community has done so many amazing things! And I must say to you now, get ready! Because we will have a bit of the rip of the frames. Um, the community has set up an amazing area over here. And it's getting a little bit framey. And we're down. Coming in for a landing. So yeah, if you notice that there's a little bit of a frame problem. We're trying to resolve it. We're fixing. It's not really a server issue. Um, it's just a build issue. We have a lot of things going on right over here. So we're going to probably be trying to spread out a little bit more. But here you can see some guys have some really, really great builds. This is a subscriber from Twitch, uh, Ostian Lo Wang, an Australian. Wait, wait, what time is it here? Oh my God, it's like tomorrow 30 for him. Home of Yen Lo Wang, soon to be cook. Small amount of crystal needed, maybe 20. <laughs> so very cool. Um, oh wait, I got to take this guy off. You run super slow. 
Whoa, what? Somebody talk to me? Uh, hello? Electric volts. What, what? We got all sorts of people going. They're talking. They're doing stuff and things. They're being a community. Um, we have over here, if you can see. Wait, do I have my spy glass? Let me go ahead and get my spy glass set up for you guys so you can see what's going on here. There is a ladder now. <laughs> we built a ladder from this bottom area right here. Oh, wait, that thing is amazing. There you can see. There's our ladder. It goes up there, goes up there, all the way to the top of the island, all the way up there with the ladder so we can get resources. We've been having some issues having enough resources. We've deforested the entire island several times, and that is most likely because we've started endgame content on the first day. That's right, ladies and gentle peeps. The Galleon! Hey, Shadow, are you able to make storage boxes? Shadow's trying to make storage boxes. The Galleon has tried to be built. There's the Unsinkable 2. There's not for sale. There's some more of our ships over here. I think this is Zach's house right there. Um, Our buddy Evil Zach, who's help, ha been helping admin for the company, right over there. Uh, and yes, over here, we have, in fact, started to build the Galleon. Um, it's an unbelievably and amazing, expensive uh endeavor. And we're doing quite well, in fact, with it. And like I said, I do apologize for ripping the frames. Uh, there's not much that I can really do about it. 234th level Alpha Seagull. I feel like we'll just leave you right where you are, homie. We don't want you destroying anything. So if we come up here, you can see we have all of our decking down right now. The Galleon is leveled up and we haven't even set sail. Hold on. Can we do this? For real? <laughs> Dude, I don't know what we need to do. I don't know how many accommodations. Ships crew 59. I don't know how this is all going to work. So we're not going to level it up yet. Um, that's cool, man. But here you can see some of our decks, and then the decks go all the way down inside of here. I think there are, what is it? One, two, three, four, five, I don't know. Six? No, no, yeah, there are. There's six decks. So we have the six decks built now. So you have to build the initial galleon. Remember, just like from the sloop video, we had to build the sloop, then we had to build the decks, then we had to build the, the stuff and things on the outside. But on the outside, are you upset? What's the matter, buddy? What's the matter over here, homie? But over here, we do have this. We started to build gun ports. Wh who's sleeping? Zach's sleeping in the ship. He loves the galleon. So here are some of our gun ports. Like so and like so. Wait, can we shut it? Shut the gun port? There we go. And then we're starting to build some of these pieces. Look, look at these guys. Bull McShui. It's Zomble, dude. So, um, yeah, it's been pretty amazing. And the community has been helping out with this as well. Uh, Zach and I have pretty much been typing nonstop for the last 24 hours. I think Zach more than me. Um, but, yeah, we've been trying to just to stay organized and continue to do stuff and things. Uh, and the community has been being very, very amazing. Um, so over here now, I think we can go like so. We can only grab like 1,500 wood at a time. And then we have to move that over inside of here like so. In before uh, structures, structures plus. We're going to need structures plus really bad in this game already. Because it takes so many crazy high amounts of resources to get things built. So in here, there's two things that we need in order to continue to build. One of them is these right here, planks. And I don't know exactly how many we need, but it's a bunch. Um, they're 1,500 wood a piece. What is that? 1,500 fiber, 24 metal, and 1,300 thatch for each one. We also need to build the gun ports. So we want to put a lot of gun ports on this. And again, 1,500, 256 metal, 1,300 thatch, and 1,500 wood. So the community has been amazing. Trying to get this guy online. I'm just going to go ahead and pull the rest of this in, I think. I do believe we should have room. Like so. And you're going to see a lot of death message spam. I don't know if there's a way to turn that off or not, but we need to try to figure it out. All right. So down inside of here now, planks. Let's go like this. How many can we make? One. That's it. Just one. And then we're out of wood again. See? So this is like, it, it's crazy. It's supposed to take, I think they were saying, I mean, I don't even know, like 20 to 40 hours worth of resource harvesting, harvesting to get the galleon up and running. And we're going to do our very best to see if we can get it up pretty soon. Uh, let's go like this and go like this. I want to just get a couple more of these guys. That should be enough for another plank, I think. Let's go like so. Another guy. Another guy. All right, so there we got three more of those bad boys. We'll come over here like so, like so, like so. And then we're putting these. Uh, I'd like to try to finish first the bottom half of the ship here. We won't need any gun ports for it. All we're going to need are the planks. So inside of here like this. I think I can queue. There we go. Over here. Like so. There we go. A couple more pieces built. Ah! We fell off. 
So, there it is, ladies and gentle peeps. The beginnings of the galleon. I mean, it's so exciting. But you saw there was three pieces, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It looks like maybe 12 per side, so 24 total planks, and then probably 24 more of the gun ports. It's definitely not something we're going to finish in this episode. Um, so there's just a huge amount of things to do and know, man. And and doing it with the community has been an interesting learning experience. And it really has changed the game quite a bit. It's been so much fun. So I'm going to go ahead today and I'm going to start to use up some of the resources that the community has gathered so we can continue to build the galleon. I'm going to go ahead and see how many of the bottom planks I can get finished. Uh, and then we're going to do some other stuff. Things. It's going to be amazing. I'll be our bees, peeps. Under cover of darkness, we have managed to make five more of these. Uh, actually, more than five more, but I think we're pretty much out of resources now. So, over here, like so. We want to go like this. Oh, we're getting close, peeps. Well, to half. Dude, wait, what? Is that halfway? Oh, whoa! Sorry, I fell. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. We fine. Oh my god, rip the frames. And we're back. All right, so is that half? Is that half of it done? Dude, I think it is. I think that's half of the bottom completed. Oh my god. Eight, two, oh wait, is there one that goes up there? Oh, I wonder if there can be a gun port there. I'm gonna wait. I'm just gonna put this one down over here. All right, so it looks like now, I can't remember how many that was, but uh, a good, uh, a great effort, a valiant effort by the community. Now, let me see here. How close are we to getting anything else done? Oh, we're done. We're done on fiber. We're done on thatch. Well, we have some. We're done on wood-ish. And then all these guys. Oh, wait. Is this metal? Oh, dude. Oh, we need that for the gun ports. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we're running a little bit low on metal in the community building. I'm going to grab some of that and give it over to the community building because I know that people are, aren't able to repair their tools or anything right now. And I think these are all empty. Yeah, kind of, sort of. We can get this guy there, there, there. And we can squirt all this into there. I think there's some fiber over there, too. I'm so fat! It's my Baywatch moment. Like so and like so. All right, so sweet. Not bad. Wait, why am I so... Is that 140 metal? Oh, my God. That's making me super fat. So we're doing pretty good. Um, plans for this area moving forward. I do think that we're going to try to uh, ask a few people, if they don't mind, to possibly move out of the bay. Um, we are going to try to finish the galleon and launch it ASAP so we can get that guy out of here uh, and probably scuttle some of the rafts. That would probably help uh, again with the lag. And then also the seaports, the ship ports. Um, we have too many of those. I don't think we need to have as many here. So I'm thinking maybe one medium, one small, one medium, one large, because I think that's how that works, right? Uh, and if I go inside of here and I go inside of here and I type ship, it shows me a huge amount of these. Where is the one that gives us the deals? The basics of sailing. That's the tiny shipyard. Then this is the small shipyard. So this tiny. Well, we don't need tiny. We only need small. And then I don't know. The large one is for the brigantine. I think the brigantine and the galleon are enlarged. So we only need to have, I think, two different sizes here. So maybe two over here for the sloops and we can get rid of that guy. And then one large over there for brigantines and galleons in case people will, will eventually we want to build those. We have to be really careful. You know, this game is so interesting. I'm learning a lot of different stuff about how it works. But the logistics of it are interesting in the way they've done things with ships. So um, if you look inside of here, you can see um, we are only allowed 800 tames for our company. We can only have 140 anchored ships and 70 unanchored ships. A total of 210 total ships. But... That's really odd because unanchored ships take, I think, damage if they're stationary. So you can't just unanchor them and leave them stationary indefinitely. Um, so, yeah, a lot of stuff and things that we're learning. It's unbelievable and amazing. These islands that we've discovered, the scattered islands that we've settled on, are really great. They're not too dangerous, but they do lack some resources. So I'm hoping that in the future we'll be able to maybe trade with other companies some of the things that we're going to need. I think that would be really, really fun. So um, that's kind of the update on what's going on with the community stuff and things. Ladies and gentle peeps, we're working on the galleon. Our sloop is doing really well. Um, we got to find out something else. What, what else are we going to do today? <laughs> I'm thinking maybe, hmm, maybe we go on a pirating adventure. It surely is a blustery day on the high seas. That's right, ladies and gentle peeps. We're going to try to head out here. 
Oh, great, of course. I feel like the intensity, not, no, no, not the intensity. The amount of these storms is unrealistic. Uh, so they're, they happen in Booty Bay all the time. Uh, let's rotate our sail, maybe like so. Let's see if we can just push out of here. So I have moved and put, or changed and put a speed sail on the unsinkable two, as opposed to the handling sail we had on before. And it's made quite a bit of difference. There also have been some changes to the way that sailing works and wind works. Um, and now I do believe when you have like no wind, you can still move forward just a little bit. Wow, dude. Oh my God. The freaking Ferrari boat. Who even knew? I didn't know they made Ferrari boats. All right, as we move away from shore, I'm gonna watch my frames. I was getting around 20 to 25 as we were in there. Now we're getting 30, 40, <laughs> 45. And we have all this flotsam and jetsam floating about. So obviously, uh, being in the area, in the main area there was causing some problems with our frames. But that's just because the community is so overwhelming. And we're at 70. All right, so feels good team. Now, what we're gonna be trying to do today is moving in a northern, north uh, westerly direction in look of treasure. We need to find some buried treasure. Now, I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to do it. I think I have all the things that we need. We have our shovel, right? I have a shovel. I have treasure maps. This is the one we're gonna be looking at. And if we pop this up like so, you'll see that looks like that. You see what I'm talking about? The lower left-hand corner of the left side map. And that is on the right side map. That's where, where we're gonna be heading. So that whole area is all the way up here. So there we are right there. There's the unsinkable two that for some reason is called Sloop. And we're gonna be moving, making our way up into this area here to see if we can find the buried treasure. Ah! Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're going straight in, kids! Yo ho, yo ho, the pirate's life for me. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It's a pirate's life for me, guys. So we just came very far. The, the way that this works in this game, uh, if you don't know about the sailing stuff, you can't kind of, sometimes you can't just sail every direction that you want because of how the wind works. So we had to come further to the west, and then we're going to try to cut straight north. So now if we look at our uh, deal, and you can actually just double tap M uh, and then just bring up your compass. And then if you middle click on it, you can make a little compass, glowy compass bearing there. So now you can see if we go like about like so, it's pretty much straight north, maybe a little bit, a little bit to the, the west. Right over here is where we're trying to head. So we got the wind in our favor-ish. Now it's still a little bit behind us. Oh, our sloop is leveled up. Options for the ship, access sloop properties. I've just been pumping weight. Um, sturdiness, sturdiness reduces the sink rate and reduces the rate of offshore item spoiling and character vitals depletion. Uh, don't really care that much about it. Additional crew, three sounds good to me. In the accommodations, we have two beds. So weight really seems to be where it's at. The unsinkable two sloop is at level 11. Oh no! Oh no, hard to port, hard to port right now, immediately. Uh, hard to port, E, uh, like so. Uh, rotate sails. A absolutely the other direction right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Rip the dream. This is dead Dude, did he not get us? I can't believe it. Oh, did we get lucky there, man? Oh My god, we got luck. Oh, there's another one hard to starboard Okay, stop like this go up here rotate sails 75 degrees the other direction Okay Love there, there, there. We're doing it, man. Check these guys out, man. Hold on. We got to go like so, and then maybe take this guy off, and then put this guy on, and then we got to wait a second. There it is, man. Oh, dude, it just poofed. Ship of the Damned, level 10. 50,000 HPs. 48,400, was it? That is crazy, man. A crazy amount of stuff and things. Okay, so wait. I think this is the island we're heading towards. We know we need to be on the, uh, what is it? Southwest corner of the island. So put these guys away. Put this guy away. Double M like, no, no, not that guy. So many things. So many things. No, wait. Four. Okay, double M. He's done it. We're going the right direction. Okay, we just got to check sometimes. We got to keep our eyes peeled for the SODs. We're almost there, peeps. Okay, we're coming in for a landing. This is getting really tough to do with one guy. Uh, Close. Close, close. We just want to go slow in through here. But there's crocs. 
There's bad hombres. There's all sorts of stuff and things. Oh, is that a bad guy? Dude, it's a croc coming at us, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, where you at? Where you at, homie? You want to go? You want to go? Stop attacking my deal. Why are you attacking my deal? Dude, how? Wow, dude, how do you hit me? You're kidding me. I'm on my boat. Where's this kid at? Okay. Ow! All right, last resort. That's what we named this guy right here. Oh, no, it's not enough. Oh, crap. Uh, mm, uh, mm. 10 seconds. What the crap? I need this now. I'm at half HPs. All I got to do is hit this guy. Wait, what is the, what is the melee? Dude, there's a melee. Oh, crap. I'm going to die. Four, four, go, go, go. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. Holy crap, you guys. Uh, uh, so close to death. Did you guys see that? What's her HP's at? Where is it? 13. Oh my God. I can't even believe it. All right. Let's get these guys reloaded. So there it is. You can see right there. Because I have the map equipped. That is where the treasure is. And we're going to have to get over there and go ahead and find it. But this area, not as nice as the scattered isles. Scattered islands, pretty unbelievable and amazing. Not a lot of terribly dangerous stuff and things go on there. But here, not cool, man. All right, let's reload these guys. I don't think I can actually bring my schooner deeper into this area. I don't think that's going to be a good idea. So I feel like maybe we're going to have to head out on foot after I get some HPs. And we're back. All right, there's bad stuff everywhere. This is this is not okay. Uh, uh... Get wrecked. All right. So this is a very slow process because every time we make a move, we have to stop and reload. And we have to play the reload mini game to increase our reload speed. Dude, it sounds just like an arc drop, dude. What? <laughs> All right. So that guy's gun. La that guy's done words. Last resort. Let's go ahead and reload the last resort. I love the look of the models. The gun looks so cool. The little skull that's on it and all that. Let's do this guy. All right. I'm going to move up a little bit closer. The only problem is like if there's a snake up here or something like that, it's bad news, man. Okay. We're good. I feel like we're okay. Okay. So we have to unequip the last resort because we can only equip one two-handed item. I'm going to take a couple seconds for this to work. Now, when this comes, when we do this, I do believe there are going to be, uh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh, what the crap? Oh, dude, they're here. It's happening now. Oh my God. It's happening now. Okay. I thought we had to dig, but I guess I was wrong. Oh, shiza. Okay. Oh. How's my HPs? Is this working? Okay. Some of these guys are big. Some of these guys are big. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. This guy right here. Okay. 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 Oh, 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 oh. Okay. This is not okay. Ugh. Oh my God. This is way harder than I thought. Oh, okay. We're at about half HPs now. Oh, these guys are easy. Hit, 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 hit. No, no. Okay, I think it's automatically locking on stuff. Oh no! Run! Oh no, I got no stamina. I'm out of stamina. Oh jeez, do you see how fast the kid is? Holy crap! Okay, no stamina still. Almost no HPs left. Oh my god, did I do it? Did I do it? Holy crap! No! He's alive! Reload, 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 reload. Move this way, move this way, move this way. Okay, feel free to regain stamina at your leisure. No! No! We died! Oh my god, that was so much harder than I thought. And I thought we did it! Okay. Attempt number 14. Get wrecked! Okay, so those guys are coming down. Here's what we're gonna do. Oh yeah, we're not doing this. Uh, 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 u
We're totally cheesing. Oh, what? Dude, it just broke my gun. <gasps> Limited guns, stuff and things. Oh, what? Okay, that guy's down. Oh, oh, hello. Okay, we've locked on. Oh, I think they regen. Interesting. Interesting. Unlock. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna try to like bob and weave here. Because we can't we can't really do anything else. We're gonna try to bob and weave. Okay, bob and weave. Bob and weave. No 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 no. Un un alt, un alt. Okay, okay, okay. Feels good team. Feels good team. Come over to this guy. Where are you going? Why are you running away? I think he's regaining HPs. So he like goes underground. So no wonder we can't find them when it keeps saying that there's like however many remaining. Oh, I think he went underground and then. Oh. Oh, oh, big guy, big guy, big guy. Ow. Oh, I can't move. I'm stuck. <gasps> okay. Okay. We're almost there. We're almost there. This guy right here. Crap, 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 crap. Hold up, hold up. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second, boys. I need some stamina. Need a little bit of hot stamina action right here. Just give me a second. Oh, there he goes. This guy right here. This guy right here. No, no, no. Don't run away. Don't run away. Okay. That guy's gone. Got that guy right there. Uh, five. Reload. Okay, is this the last one? I really hope this works. If it doesn't, I'm giving up. This will be like the fourth time we've tried this. Okay, this guy here. We're just kiting. No. Okay, fine. Let's use the time to reload. Here, come back. Oh, is this already reloaded? Okay, I'm gonna get this gun going here. Oh, oh, I hear you, Snake. Oh no, it's the opposite snake! Come on, let me reload my gun. Let me reload my gun. Okay, one big hit. No, don't go under the crowd! No, I got it, Snake! Ah, I'm gonna die. So over for me. Ah, I died! With all of his armor broken and his pride defeated, Shipwreck Van Dam made his whoa, 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 made his way back to his home port. Ladies and gentle peeps, that's gonna be it for today. If there's one thing that we've learned, it is that don't pirate alone. Ladies and gentle peeps, don't pirate alone. We're definitely gonna be doing some of these treasure maps, but I think I will. Enlist the help of some more scurvy dogs from the Booty Barnacles Company to get it done in the future. We are currently heading southeast back to the Booty Bay to hang out with our peeps. Thank you so much for coming to hang out with me today. Make sure if you like the video, please don't forget, show your support, smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the video as you see fit. And may the stuff of things be with you. <laughs> Look at my arm. What's wrong with my arm? <laughs>